I'm not going to say any names in this video, but someone that I talked to on the phone recently that I haven't talked to in a long time is having this interesting conversation about growing up and people being flawed and assuming all the time, not knowing what they're talking about. We had a good talk, a real, real good talk. But what I noticed was he changed and matured this much. But his mentality and thought stayed sort of kind of the same. Now, it's all well and good to mature and expand on your opinion. But if some of your tendencies are still the same as they were in middle school, then maybe you're not the one that ought to be talking as much as you are. Now, I'm not going to say that the conversation was interesting and didn't pass by a time that I didn't enjoy the talk, but I'm just saying, this young man has a lot of progressing to do. So far, so good. Growing up, whatever, whatever. Middle school, high school, blase, blase. He's alright, academically. Got his little car, his little friends, his little dress code. You know, everybody who wants to be the best dress, but you know, I just think that people got a lot of maturing to do. But that train of thought, their opinions, being open-minded or closed-minded or too broad, talking too much, or, you know, high school is very immature. But what I do say about this one young man is that I agree with one of his viewpoints. It's something that he did. Even though he's still, I guess you could say, trying to get past a lot of the things that high schoolers do sex, drugs, partying, whatever, he went to church. He went to church and got baptized, y'all. Baptized. To me, that speaks. That's like a stepping stone. First step to trying to change or better yourself. I commend him a million times because me, nah, I ain't been baptized. I don't do a lot of crazy stuff, but I haven't gotten baptized. I don't read the Bible like I should. I don't even know if he reads the Bible. But then, we were also talking about tattoos. He wants to get some Bible verse on his arm or his chest or something. Deuteronomy. Y'all can look it up. So I was like, that's cool, you know, to each their own. But I do commend him and give him his props on that. Taking the one step forward that a lot of young men wouldn't. And going to church. And getting baptized. And talking about it. And not being afraid or ashamed. So for that... Give me two thumbs up.